Hello and welcome. In this video I'm going to try and uh, put a FPV camera in the front of this uh, Sima X20. It flies really well. I have done a review of it. But as I said, I'm, I'm, I may put a uh, camera in, which I'll, I'll attempt to do now. So we'll follow along. As you know, it flies really well. Let's do a quick indoor test now and then if I manage to fit the camera in to bind it up and down and then to, to set the calibration bottom right it's got the flashing you can automatic take off via these or just lift it up and it flies, okay, it flies really well only four screws holding it as well Very good fit. Okay. This Wi Fi board. You've got three wires. I have to solder this onto the board. So what I can do, I'll measure these and the foam is 2mm. The thickness of the board is 3.7. So it's all how much room there is in here. By taking the sponge out, I've got no room at the bottom, put some two sided tape on here or some insulating tape on, let it short the battery out, and then see if this will physically fit in here. If so, then I'll be able to do it. <coughs> so I'll take the sponge off first. Then see if this will fit. Take this off first. And then will this fit on? I can sort this camera out in a minute. Okay, oops. Yeah, it will just fit. So now, knowing that, I'll solder it on. I want it, um, the FPV to come on when I press the power button. If I wire it just to these positive and negative is going to be on all the time. Okay I've tried all different combinations on the circuit board and as soon as I power on with the button uh, it switches both off. So I can't use the circuit board but if I connect it to the main power supply which is the this one 
it'll come on and stop on but that'll be no good because I can't disconnect the battery so the other, other alternative I've got is to put a switch on so the switch I'm thinking about using is this tiny one that I could probably fit to the bottom like here and then when I want the FPV on I can just connect push it, these leads together to switch the FP on, FPV on I could probably have it so on the central like this so, uh, it's about the only way I'm going to have it switch it on, on and off so I'll fit that in now and all I'm going to do is fit this to the main power supply and the other end to these blue and red wire The lens is the lights now in. PV that way. Line everything up. Okay, it's just a matter now of um, putting the front cap on, putting the screws in, put some more tape round here because it came off, and then we'll, I'll show you the finished result. Okay, this is the completed version. We've got the FPV camera built in for this lens, and the plug at the bottom. So we'll plug this in now. The FPV light should come on and then connect the phone okay. so now you're about to fly FPV uh, on this small drone put it on my phone I can mount that probably on here so this is the live video from here. So I'll leave that there so I can show you. Turn on the quadcopter. Calibrate. Bottom right. Base. As you can see it works and that's the FPV in the Soma X20. So, hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.